Yes, 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 yo, Mr. Mr. IMAX in the building. How you doing, brother? <laughs> I'm doing good. We have the MO Max MacBook Pro, iPhone 14 Pro, and the Sony ZV saying, yeah, we're doing a webcam video quality test and audio quality test and features test and also convenience test. This is live video going on right now. So yeah, right now we're using the inbuilt webcam of the MO Max MacBook Pro. We're on vertical mode, but you can switch to horizontal mode. This is horizontal mode, but I guess you prefer the Vertical mode because you're using your iPhone. Yeah, if I was on the laptop, the, the horizontal mode would be we'll make more nice. sense. We'll make more sense. Yeah. You're using the 13 Pro now, yeah? Uh, yeah, 13, 13 Pro Max. Yeah. Okay. So the only feature I have here, apart from the only effect that this one can do is that you can just do the portrait. So the portrait is on right now. It just blows maybe my uh, the background yeah, a little bit. Yeah. But it doesn't do a very good job. It's just still like it blows my hair a little bit. But well, anyways, I don't care about that. So, so I think, I think, yeah, I think why you can't do that properly is just the, the the depth of field. You can't really get the depth of field like your main camera would do. Yeah. It has. So yeah, that's yeah. But it does a good job. That's for the MO Max MacBook Pro. Just look at how it looks, so that when I switch, you tell me what you can observe between the two. Okay. Sorry. So you can tell me what you can observe. Also, the sound will change when I switch to my iPhone video. I can also switch to my iPhone audio if I want to. So that's what I'll do now. Mm -hmm. So this is the MacBook. So now let's switch to the iPhone. We just it's called continuity camera. It's a new feature of the Mac OS Ventura. That's the new OS. Just in that when I updated about yes. twenty or You're on iOS sixteen, right? Um on my um, iPhone, yeah. yeah, yes. Because I think you also need, 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 need iOS sixteen. Two or point one, yeah. Okay, you need iOS iOS sixteen to do it so. So now let me switch to the iPhone. So you tell me what you yeah. notice, which you prefer. I know. So I'm switching. I'm switching. Okay, so I've switched now. Oh, that is crisp. It's crisp? That is crisp. Okay. I can see, I can see nearly all the details on your face, everything. That is crisp. Yeah, so even on my flaws, I know you're going to see it. <laughs> my beard, my hair too, right? Yeah. Yeah. Very crisp. Yeah. Let me so change. Is that, is that okay. the front-facing camera? No, this is the, this is the rear-facing camera. Rare, yeah. so the rare facing camera, true. yeah. So I have the iPhone on the stand, or okay. like a, a phone stand, and the Sony too as well. So what I can also do is that the sound is still coming from my MacBook, but let me switch the sound now to the iPhone microphone. Um, okay. So I switch the audio now. Tell me if you can notice the difference and which so, you prefer. I, so now I can hear. It sounds a little bit echoey. Okay. Um, the other one you raised before sounds more dialed in. Okay. But this sounds more like you're in a. I can I can get a sense of space of where you are in at the moment. I can tell there is space around you. It's, so it's more echoey in a, in a way. Yeah, the phone is still there. Okay. It's okay. It's still good. But you prefer the MacBook microphone. Yes. Okay. The phone. The, can you switch back to the MacBook? Um, um, before I switch here, the funny thing is that immediately I switched to the iPhone, your own sound changed as well. Your own sound really? now felt like the more isolated, like the background noise more isolated. I could hear your voice more. You understand? Yeah. Just now. I don't know, but let me switch back and so see. If you if you remember on, on the iPhones, you have the ability to check to to set your sound modes, mm. um, to your mic modes to either special, standard and Yes, isolated. yes, but you didn't switch yours, like you didn't change yours just now. Like, I think mine should be, I don't know, probably on mine's the standards. Like mine's on standard on, as well. I'll put it on voice isolation at the moment, okay. Um, that's a little bit different, right? It's a bit different. Voice isolation, yeah. So okay, yeah. let me yeah, do let me, let me do voice isolation too. So, this voice isolation in mine, how is yeah, it? So, how is it? Is it good? It sounds, it sounds a little bit dialed in better than the initial one. Okay. Then yeah. there's also wide spectrum, right? But yeah, there's wide spectrum. I'll put mine on wide spectrum also. Mm -hmm. And wide spectrum. I think this is the best. Mine is on wide spectrum, so I think this is the best. Yeah, that I can hear, I I can can hear the echo in your room. Yeah. Now. Yeah. Very well. I don't know if it's the same with mine. Yours, I don't, think, I don't think you have echoes in your room to start with. So maybe because my place is um, that echoes yes, here so naturally. Well. So yes, yours just amplified the sound more, and there are no echoes. Okay, so I just I just put it back on um, isolation. 
Okay. That's why I like this new video. Which one did you like the most amongst the theory just now? That I just tried for my I, end? For yours, I think it's the isolation. The voice isolation? Yeah. Okay. okay. Okay, so let me switch it back to... Um, what do you call it? The FaceTime... To the MacBook microphone. Okay. okay, so I'll switch back to the MacBook microphone. Okay. So now, now you're more dialed in now. I'm more dialed in now. Yeah, I can hear your voice. Um, what's the words you use? Like you're using a, a dedicated mic. Yeah. Oh, wow. That's that. Um, so the MacBook like microphone, the MacBook microphone beats the TV order like video effects when we're using the iPhone. Yeah, yeah, uh -huh. yeah. The MacBook mic sounds more refined. It sounds okay. like you're using a dedicated mic. Okay. You okay. know, because I know um, the the MacBook has um, different mic arrays to give you a much more, array, more yeah. like studio like sound. Yeah. So yeah, I'm sure I'm sure that's why. Very, very correct. The theory mic are And also, the iPhone is a little bit further away from me than the MacBook. Okay. Yeah, so okay. that might also stay out to you. But then again, I still feel like the MacBook microphone is a better microphone than the iPhone. So, yeah. I'm on, I'm on, I'm on that with you. <laughs> okay, so let me start showing the effects now. So, this is Studio Lights. Studio on the Light. iPhone 14 Pro Max. Yeah. On the 14 Pro, not Pro Max, 14 Pro. Studio Light basically increases the brightness of the subject. And then reduces mm -hmm. the brightness of the background. The background, yeah. Yeah, I, I think. Yeah, I noticed the highlights in your program drops. Yeah, okay. this before. <clears throat> yeah, I can see it, yeah. And then this after. After. Yeah. Okay. So, this before. <clears throat> yeah, I can see it, yeah. And then this after. After. Yeah. Okay. You probably know this one already, the center stage. So, it's using the auto wide lens. Quality drops, right? Mm -hmm. Quality drops, yes. Very okay. noticeable. Very noticeable. Then. Oh yeah. So wait, is that on? Is that on the iPhone or? Is the iPhone? Let me change okay, it back to. Let me change it back to. Is that your? Is that your? Okay. Auto wide. Yeah. Yeah. Auto wide lens. So it's basically cropping in, and then when it needs to crop back, it crops out more. And if I stand, okay. it tracks me. You understand? So, oh, yeah. so the lens yeah. is covering a very wide array. But it's also yeah. you go to zoom in, then when you not when you not go up, it now like because it's zoomed in already, it has like some extra yeah. space at the top yeah. frame that you can now like go up to. So that's what it does. Very smart move by Apple. Very smart. You know, the, the, Very smart. The iPad has this already, but the MacBook Pro webcam doesn't. Yeah. Mm, that's the inbuilt. Yeah. The inbuilt uh, model Yeah. This thing, yeah. So like I said, the quality is way worse in this one, yeah. It's clear that the mm -hmm. quality is not as good. good. It's still good. It's still it's still possible light. It's still possible. Okay. Yeah, yeah. It's still good. Come like my lighting is quite good too. So yeah. Mm -hmm. So let me turn off center stage. This is back to okay. the wide lens of the iPhone 14 Pro. It's using the wide lens now. Then we have portraits as usual, just to blur mm -hmm. the background. So let's turn that off. Then this yeah, is. The, I think I think I think before um, the we to nail this whole portrait thing properly, it will take a while. It's, cause oh, it's, it's still good. It's, it's possible, yeah. Yeah, it's because the software. Funny enough, in the cinematic mode, it, it, it's getting better and better. It's still not yeah. perfect, but it's getting there. You understand? I still notice like some my hair at the top getting blood out when I'm using cinematic mode. But the cool thing is that I can adjust the f-stop. So I can put the f-stop at like let's say 7.18 and then it, it gets reasonable. To make it natural, yeah. Make it look make more it natural. Look so yeah, yeah they're getting there. Then we have Dex view. Which is, I think, the most incredible one. That is. That <laughs> is just, Let me change back to vertical. Let me change back to so vertical. I, so I watched the, um, the, 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 the presentation of everything yeah. when they launched um, the whole stuff. And yeah. literally when I saw the text view, mm -hmm. I was like, yo, this is next level. Yeah. You know, being able to use your iPhone as, as not just the phone, yeah. but a webcam, and also a top-down ca camera. Top-down camera. So, what I really want to check now is to see if it's going to be, like, if you're able to see my face and okay. the, the, the the what's on my desk at the same time, and how well it works. And how cute it be. Yeah, and how it will be like on your screen as well, as well. Yeah. So, first things first, to start it, I can adjust the area I want. Let me just start it in a wide form, I'll adjust it up. So, I've started it now. Let me know if you can see. Let me know when you can see it. 
I am still seeing your face. Okay. Okay, uh, let me share the view. Okay, I'm sharing it now. Let me know if you can see my face. Cool. Okay. Can you see my face? I can see that now, but your your network policy is um well I can see it here, yeah. Okay. My network quality is messing up. Yeah, so I can see that now, yeah. I can okay. see it. So you can see my okay. okay, you can see my face okay. and you can see the desk. I can't see your face no. From the from the top down view, uh, if you use that is that no, no, no. I, I'm guessing like a separate one will have my face in it. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes, yes, yes. yes. I, I have put Okay, separate, cool, yeah. cool. Yeah. So basically, I can now, like, let's say if I'm teaching from the teacher, I can still, okay, if 10... I can put your writing very well, yeah. Plus it's x is equal to 35. Find x. I don't know what this is, but anyways. So what I can do now is that I can zoom. <laughs> I can zoom in, yeah, so I can see what I'm yeah. doing better. Which is which is very brilliant. Yeah, I can zoom in, then I can zoom out back. So this is the widest. Mm -hmm. It doesn't get the orientation very well, like of my hand mm -hmm. and all, but at least it's, it's trying. I think for the hand it's funny, but for the yeah. text, for the text on what is there, it's pretty alright. Yeah, mm. it is. It is photo. Yeah, so you can it's see. Or I can draw. Let me draw. Let me draw you. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you have to add the camera, please. After what? You have to add the camera to it. The camera to it, no other. Yeah. <laughs> What's all done? <laughs> Guy, I'm an artist. Oh I'm, I'm a... <laughs> Guy, I'm an artist too. Forget. I used to be an artist that year. Stop it, man. Stop it. Guy, I don't want to draw cameras. So how do I draw cameras? <laughs> <laughs> this, is, this is Picasso standard. Picasso. Pablo. <laughs> Anyways. Oh, my God. That is for well, yeah, yeah. That's for yeah, the even if even if your hands even if your hands are skewed, mm. um, what's on the paper is perfect. Yeah, which is really really cool. Yeah, perfect. Okay. So I just feel like that is just next level tech, to be honest. Yeah. So let me stop sharing though. Are you okay with Dexview? Do you like Dexview? I love it. Alright. So let me stop. <laughs> let me stop sharing though. <laughs> let me stop Dexview. So I'm back to. Normal form, right? Let me now show you the Sony. Well, let me know what you think about the Sony. So this is the Sony now. Okay. So your your source of audio, where is it coming from? My source of audio now is coming from my Sony, but I have a microphone on top of it as well, like attached to the Sony. Um, okay. So it's a Rode Video Micro. It's on the hot shoe mount of the Sony ZV E10, and then I attached, I connected the CRF yep. cable to the Sony ZV E10, and then the Sony is connected to the MacBook using a Type C to Type C USB cable. So how's the quality of this okay. one? The quality I'll say is more refined. Hmm. It's not. <clears throat> I think it looks natural. Okay. Um, not as sharp processed as what the Mac offered. Okay. But to the print eyes. Um, they will easily pick the MacBook. Um, sorry, the iPhone. Uh, wasn't that of the? They'll pick that of the iPhone. The iPhone, okay. Because of how sharp and crisp, you know, showing all the details and everything. Yeah. That's why I roll naturally. But this is a more natural looking um, picture to me, video to me. Yeah. Um, the depth of field looks accurate. Yeah. And everything I'm seeing. Yeah. So this looks more natural to me. Though there is kind kind of like a this blurring effect going on around. Oh, I see. Yeah. But uh, it looks more natural to me. Looks more natural. So, yeah. iPhone is first. Which is second? The MacBook or the Sony? The Sony. The Sony is second. MacBook is last. Yeah. yeah. Why is MacBook the last? So, in this webcams, you know, um, on laptops, I don't feel like they have gotten to the point where they will be on par with devices like the iPhone, which we know one of the selling points with iPhone is the camera. Yeah. You know? So I feel like the engineering that they've done on the iPhone is way more better than what you get on the MacBook. Spot on, spot on. So I can, I can, equate, I can equate the front-facing camera from your iPhone with what the, um, the MacBook Pro is offering. Oh, okay. Um, 
is a bit more refined. Mm-hmm. But that, I'll say they are both on the same level because even for the iPhone, um, I know Apple knows that most people don't want to take like exotic, lovely pictures. We use the rear cameras. So yeah. That's where they're going to spend more time yeah. as opposed to the front-facing camera or your webcam on your system. I feel you. Although they updated the camera of the iPhone 14 Pro a bit, the front-facing camera, they added autofocus. And when they added autofocus, my mind I was like, are you trying to tell me that the old front-facing cameras do not have autofocus? It's, it was quite confusing. It's, it's funny, yeah. Apple has this funny way of doing things. Yeah. <laughs> so this is the Sony now with the Rode Video Micro attached to it. So audio level and quality is better on the Sony. Okay. It sounds, it sounds more louder and sounds more dialed in okay okay on the mac it's good but it's it's a bit on the softer side okay okay yeah, so this sounds more like straight up more natural oh that's cool we can also do the focus thing here too surprisingly the focus on okay. the sunny yeah but it's still like the mac that is using software to just do it yeah oh okay Apart from the fact that we can do this continuity camera thing, another thing we can do is let me switch back to my webcam on the Mac. That's the MO Max internal webcam. This is what it is right now. Okay. So this is it. So you know you said that it's comparable to front facing, it's most likely going to be comparable to the front facing camera of of yeah, um, still good, yeah. Yes. So now let, let's act we can actually try that because as well on this call right now, yeah, we can switch to the iPhone and continue the webcam call on the iPhone. All I need to do is to bring my iPhone. I'll just pick up my iPhone. So on my dynamic island, yeah, I don't know if you can see, mm-hmm. but on my dynamic island, I can just tap on the dynamic island. There's a video sign on the dynamic yeah. island. Yeah. yeah I so I'll just tap on it and then uh, switch. You can, can you see it? Yeah. Okay. okay. So I'll just, <laughs> I'll just switch. So move call to this iPhone, switch. So it's connecting. So it's going to stop the one here and then it's going to start here. Mad, sharp, sharp. <laughs> no time. See, that is the, that is the beauty of, of using, or of being in the Apple ecosystem. It is just seamless and, you know. I know, it's, man. It's beautiful. I know. Yeah. Quality wise, how is it? Is MacBook Pro better? Video quality wise. I'd say this is more sharper. Okay. I think the MacBook Pro does a lot of um, softening. Yeah, softening too. Yeah, yes. Yeah. So this is much more this is a little bit much more sharper. Yeah. 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 Okay. It's much more sharper, yeah. Okay. I'll give this a pass to the to the MacBook Pro. So iPhone rear camera number one. Um the Sony Z V ten number two iPhone front facing camera number three, a MacBook Pro webcam last. Yeah. Well, it's, it's, it's a very small sensor, the one on the MacBook, so I don't blame it. And um, yeah. It's, yeah, yeah it's, it's, there's nothing much. It's just taking a very small part of the distance. It's not only taking a very small part actually. This thing is quite big. Let me even show you. I, I can switch camera. This is a, this is notch is big now, so it's supposed to fit in big. Well, I think I think. Uh, ah, this yeah, is a big notch. Is it the lighter or what's it called? It, it doesn't have the face. Um, it doesn't. It doesn't have face ID. So I'm like, why? What's what that space really for? You understand? It's just it's just basically two sensors that the one is the front facing camera, which is the webcam. The other one is like um, this indicator that lets you know when your FaceTime is on and stuff like that. The dynamic island has that indicator too. Then the rest part of it is the, I don't I can't see any sensor. It's basically nothing there. So I feel like if they didn't utilize the space well, or maybe they did not just have the technology ready yet for what they would have been able to put there, like face ID and other things. True, true. What about the sound of this? Is this the sound good too? Um, so is that, is that the um, sound from the iPhone? Sound from the iPhone. I think yeah, so. Yeah, so it, it's a bit, a bit of hiss and miss here and there because I can still get echoes around. Um, so no less you, you're dialed it into voice isolation, I can still get echoes. So the mic on the... On the Mac, mm. it's pretty decent standard. Okay. What I have at the moment. Okay. The mic on the Sony is number one, yeah. Yes. Followed by the MacBook Pro, yeah. Then followed yeah. by the front-facing camera of. Yeah. Followed by the yeah. iPhone in general. I'm switching back now to 
to the MacBook. So I'm switching back. Let's see. We're back. Two seconds. Everywhere. Don't bust. Now your audio sounds very settled and... The audio is coming from the ZV-E10 right now. Okay, from the from the sound, yeah. Yeah, so now this one, now let me remove the microphone. Sounds settled. Let me remove the microphone. I have to increase okay. the levels first. So I've moved the microphone now. <laughs> How does it sound? Nah. What happened? <laughs> nah, you sound far from... <laughs> you sound you sound like you're in a very kind of like empty room. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. But it's still good though. It's yeah. Still good. Yeah. It's still good. But is it worse so far? Yeah, it's the worst so far. No, I don't. It's the worst so far. So if you're using the Sony, make sure it gets an external microphone to use with it. Otherwise, audio okay. wouldn't be the best for putting back the microphone. Sounds like you're in an empty room. Okay. I'm back on the Sony. Yeah, now you're back. I'm back. <laughs>